Hey there guys, what's going on? Sloppy here, happy Sunday. Let's do some more Creativerse adventures. And this one seems pretty interesting. It's built as part of the Happy Harbor community build. Uh, Happy Harbor, if I remember correctly, I did a world tour of a while back and it's a crazy impressive world. This is an imitation of the Hungarian parliament in Budapest. And the thumbnail just looks impressive. If I'm being honest, that's why I clicked it. I looked at it and thought, gosh toot and darn it, that looks like a sweet parliament. So, let's do it. <laughs> Alright. Oh. This is awkward. I thought there was going to be a second checkpoint. Okay, I'll just, I'll get back in. Alright, I just won't click the checkpoint this time. Um, so, it says Happy Harbor Museum. Uh, I guess that's where we are. There's lots of stuff on the shelves. I assume there's a way out of here. I just want to see the Parliament building. Um, I just kind of assumed there was a way out of here. Maybe? Wait, what? Where am I? Why can't I... don't understand. Frame adventure. I understand. That means so you can get it for your picture frame. <sighs> okay, well that's disappointing. Let's move on to the next one. Well, after that embarrassing start, I thought, why not do something that requires me to not press any buttons? So here we go. The Icy Coaster 3.0. I'm always curious when people make these coasters in these games. Because uh, a lot of times they're just pretty awesome. I should have pressed record a little bit further into the loading screen. We're good. We're good. Alright. Alright. We're up in the mountains. I'm seeing a lot of coaster. I'm seeing a lot of coaster. Just see what we can see. Checkpoint over there. Okay. There's a teleporter here. What was I standing on? That's bedrock wall. Part of the world hasn't loaded in yet. Which I feel like I should let it load in. All right, let's 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 see what happens. Let's see what happens. We're going down. Ooh, we fell off a little bit. Ooh, look at this guy. Ooh. I don't know if I've ever done, like, one of the... What are they called? A cyclone? I don't know what they used to call these. The roller coaster tycoon, but I don't know if I've ever been on one. This is awesome. This is a pretty cool little roller coaster design. I don't know if I've ever been on one of these inside of Creativerse. Boy, how good was Roller Coaster Tycoon, huh? Not the new ones. The old one. Although I hear Planet Coaster is pretty good. I don't know. I didn't trust my computer to run it, you know? Ooh, slow down a little bit. Go right out. Shooting, shooting. Ooh. This is a lot of ice. <laughs> this is a lot of ice, fam. Is that bad? That's all I can think of when I'm in this? It's just like, wow, they used a lot of ice. Oh, this is... Oh, boy, that was a bit of a... Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, that's cool. Is that something that happens if you go through successive teleporters? Is that like, look how much whiter it gets. Oh, and then like you kind of can't see? That's a really cool mechanic. Maybe I can use that at some point. If you go through a lot of teleporters, it like whites out your vision. That's pretty neat. That's pretty neat. This is well made. That's all I can say. Wait a minute, were you blinking between the two of them? And then eventually, do you just go so fast you miss the last one? Or maybe they turn it off or something? Okay, that's pretty sweet. Because I think that was only two teleporters. Were they all all two teleporters? Blah, 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 blah. Like back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. So it feels like you're going down a large trunk of track, but you're not. Those are pretty cool. This guy put a lot of thought into this coaster. A lot of thought into this coaster. I kind of want to go check out... I think there was one right over there. I want to check out these teleporters. I'm so curious. This is a huge mountain range. Really impressive. You know, I wish... Now, this is this is just something I'm using. Like, I would love to see somebody do one of these roller coasters, but do those big, like, wooden struts, you know? Like the old big wooden roller coasters have. Yeah, look at this. This is... So you're just going through two teleporters. I'm going to... Goes back, goes back, goes back, goes back, goes back, and then maybe eventually you just skip right through it? Yeah. 
If you go so fast through a teleporter, do you just not... Does it just not recognize you? Is that a thing? Am I crazy? This is a really well-made roller coaster, though. Icy Coaster 3.0. Ooh, I wonder what the people who did the first two uh, have to say about them, but this is... This is really cool. Very, very cool. All right. Let's get the achievements or whatever. Oh, there's not even frames anymore. What's the point of finishing adventures? Am I right? Anyway, uh, that's really cool. Let's go check out another one. I think that is just so neat. No, it might be a little bit shorter day. I'm still kind of sick, so I'm just... Look at this loading thing. It's a limestone pillar mixed with a stair next to the word loading. That's weird. Right? Okay. Anyway, so yeah, if it's a little bit shorter, I'm still kind of sick, so I'm uh, gonna rock and roll. Warning. Reach each checkpoint by parkour into them once you've activated a checkpoint. A door down the hall to your right will open up. Door will open to a tiny room to teleport at each one. Okay, so it's like the save method uh, type thing that we've seen in other adventures. The save method. Bloop. Oh, come on. Put it close enough that you don't have to load. Ugh. If each one of these is a loading screen, I'm going to be kind of pissed. I hate when they do that. You have to put your teleporters close enough so you don't get a loading screen every time. Uh. Alright, alright, alright. I've perfected my parkour skills through the years. Through the years. In the last... In a very short amount of time. Okay, uh, I think I'm just going to try and avoid the goo. Which I did not do. Yeah, that hurt. That hurt. Okay. Um, don't avoid the goo. I am curious to see if the save screen thing still works. There was a really good adventure a while, like a ways back, that had this really great save mechanic with the doors and the teleporters. It's just such an easy way to do it. <sighs> okay. Oh my goodness. This is gonna be every time. 10% door. Don't give me a loading screen. Hate you. Hate you so much. Ugh. And it's like so easy. You could have just built this next to it or... Ah, whatever. I'm a grouchy old man when I'm sick, apparently. Grouchy old man. Okay, uh... <sighs> Welcome back to Grouchy Old Man, uh, does parkour. Tier with Sloppy Gaming, um... Hello, how are you? There we go, let's just avoid goo blocks altogether. Oof, 20%. All right. Uh, okay, okay. This one was pretty easy. Bloop. 30%. Uh, okay. Ooh. Can I just jump this without hitting the fans? I can, okay. Whew, sorry, I'm not talking much. Oh my goodness, that was a leg. That was a leg bump, I tell ya. Um, you know like when you're lagging and you press backwards and then the leg hits and so you go too far? That was one of those. I promise you it wasn't just me falling because that was such an easy jump. Come on now. What are we at, 40%? I don't know. I don't know, man. I really... Ugh, like... Atticus, I love you. Your parkour is actually pretty good. It's one of the better ones I've seen, but... Loading screens, man. Loading screens! Non-stop! <sighs> okay, get into this. Come on, man. I'm in my own head now, you know what I mean? You gotta, you gotta have the mental part of the game down before you can... <sighs> okay, I'm good. I'm good. Shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it off Chicago, am I right? Right? Disney? I think? That girl that's famous for that show, and now is famous for doing things online that perhaps are a little bit less than reputable. Shake it off, Chicago. Okay, okay. 
Okay. This is where I had the lag last time. Nope, that was a missed jump. Oh my goodness. All right, we got the 40%. Uh, it was actually fairly easy once you got past it. Um, okay, let's just continue this, continue this, continue this. Okay, this is a little trickier. Okay, let's get on top. Ooh, almost had that leg hit me. Can't stop me now. 50%, halfway done. Okay. Um, ooh, this is interesting design. Figure just get as far over as we can. Okay, okay. You know, doing these adventures, you know, at least a video every week, and then, you know, playing them on my own time, I've gotten relatively good at some of the parkour mechanics, but then there's just some of them that I just can't do. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, baby. Okay, water is one that I can't do. <laughs> Uh, water is one that I can't do. Um, hmm. How doth I do this? Ooh, uh, oh. Oh, I thought... I thought there was nothing at the bottom. Okay, this is fairly easy, actually. I missed it. I don't know how... How do I get from... The top of the water over I don't know actually I haven't actually been able to get across this yet but I was able to hit the checkpoint uh, which is basically the same thing right <laughs> I may have cheated it a little bit but um, I mean I got it yeah I'm just gonna yeah I'll just I, I count that I count that all right here we go um, fences uh, Fences are tricky. <laughs> oh. Oh. Bloop. There we go. Okay, vines. Um. It looks like we should actually just be able to completely not do anything with the vines. Yeah, I just didn't. I just didn't sprint there. But we looks like we don't even have to touch the vines. Maybe they're just there as like a trap. I don't know. It seems like a really easy last level though, right? Maybe. Maybe I'll let you guys sit through the loading screens with me because um, I've had to do a lot of loading screens. Lots of loading screens. Boy, oh boy. Boy, oh boy. I mean, it just... Ooh, one more door. One more door. I'm actually committed to beating the Skyblock parkour. I will say it's not as hard as some of the other parkours I've seen in adventures, but it's like... It's challenging enough, you know, you have to play a little bit here, there, everywhere, so... What? It's challenging enough that you have to play a little, you know, you have to, like, try a little bit harder, but it's not, you know, that challenging, I guess? I mean, I can beat it, so... If you're good at parkour, I mean... Hmm... Oh! Hit that ladder! Ew! Oh, okay. Oops, I think I misplaced the last checkpoint. Go through the teleporter to search for it. If you flip the switch before you go... Flip the switch before you go, you might want these. Oh, okay, so there's some sort of monster waiting for us. <laughs> some sort of monster waiting for us that we have to kill. That's a fun little surprise at the end. Fun little surprise. And... Nope, still more loading screens. Oh, we go through the 100%, maybe? Another loading screen. Uh. Oh, okay. Well, that was... We really didn't... He didn't spawn them as aggressive, so it didn't really... All right, cool. Uh, Skyblock parkour, pretty cool little thing. If you don't mind the loading screens, it's a pretty cool little parkour. We saw some interesting stuff today. The Vegas Strip was kind of different. Um, I saw a frame adventure for the first time. Didn't know those, well, I guess I knew those existed. I just have never accidentally been in one. Either way, um, 
yeah, some random Sunday adventuring. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, a bit different of a video. It was tough to find, tough to find adventures. So if you guys have a world I should go tour or adventures I should check out, please let me know in the comments down below because it's getting harder and harder to find good ones. Although with the new blueprint update, maybe people will make really cool adventures. I don't know. Either way, um, leave a like if you enjoyed. Give me some ideas in the comments down below. Let me know what you think of the blueprint update still, now that it's been out almost a week at this point with this video. And uh, subscribe more Creativeverse, all that jazz, and I will catch you guys next time. A ciao!